as I walk through the forest along this moonlit coastal path, I am watching every step. This is snake territory and home to some of the most venomous snakes in the world. Suddenly, I come to an opening. I hear the sound of beautiful music, happy chattering voices. This is what I came looking for. Keep watching. There's no doubt, Koh Rong is a beautiful island with its white, sandy, clear water, pristine paradise beaches, beautiful unspoiled surroundings, perfect place for a romantic holiday, or even if you just want to get away from the hustle and bustle and chill out for a little while, this is definitely the perfect destination. But Kev, what about the nightlife, I hear you ask? Well, if you're looking for your go-go bars, your nightclubs, your live music venues and that kind of thing, I think you're going to be a little bit disappointed. I mean, some of the hotels have got some light entertainment in the evenings, and if you go down to the main village, you'll find some bars where you can have a few drinks and uh, chat the night away if you want to. But generally speaking, hardcore partying is not that kind of island. You know that I know that you know that no matter where you are in this beautiful world, there is always something going on somewhere. You just have to find it. Unfortunately for you, you are in the good hands of Uncle Kev, who is a lifelong party animal, and I won't go down without a fight until I find out where that party is. Guess what? I found it. This venue is a bit of a mission to get to, but in some ways, that's what makes it even more exciting. You could walk along long set beach all the way to the end until you come to like a little forest, uh, go through the forest and you will get there. Or you could go by scooter down a rickety bumpety old road, uh, which is absolutely fine going there. But when you've had a few drinks, coming back could be a little bit of an issue. I'm going to walk the beach way to this venue tonight. And as I know it's going to be a long night, I've also decided I'm going to stop and have myself a pizza on the way. I've never had a Cambodian pizza before, so it's the first time for everything. Looking forward to this one, this could be interesting. So I've decided to have a pizza, and I'm getting it from this little pizza shack. It's night time, so I don't know if you can see that too well, but it's on the Ko Rong Beach, and it's I've ordered a um, prosciutto fungi, which is with meat. So yeah, let's check this out. Pizza in Cambodia. Could be interesting. Nice little bar I got here. Ocean blue bar. I'm actually starving, so I thought I'd stop in and try a pizza in Cambodia. Strange as it may seem, but I'm actually fucking starving, so I've decided to have a pizza in Cambodia and I've chosen this little bar. Nice little bar, middle of the night. And yeah, I'm gonna treat myself to a pizza. Let's see how this pans out. Right, well, I've ordered my pizza. It's uh, one with meat. Sorry, vegetarian, but it's the way it is. Look at that. Pizza in Cambodia. I'm having a bit of a hair, bad hair day as usual. Anyway, back to the pizza. Well, I know it's going to be hot. You know what? Pretty good. Yeah. 
Pizza in Cambodia. Thoroughly enjoyed that. But anyway, moving on gracefully, let's get this party started. Yeah. 